today I'm going to be reading Do You Really Want a Guinea Pig? And with my pet turtle. So you say you want a guinea pig. You really, really want a guinea pig? But do you really re want a guinea pig? just your home but a cage. The cage will need soft bedding, a box for sleeping and hiding, a water bottle and most important a full food bowl. You'll need to feed your guinea pig twice a day. If you don't, you'll complain with a loud squeaks. After all, he's hungry, and eating is a guinea pig's favorite pastime. I'm starving. Feed your guinea pig hay, guinea pig pellets, and vegetables. But don't give him potatoes, onions, or iceberg lettuce. Those will give him a, him a tummy ache. And if you don't forget... Fruits is natural candy, especially to guinea pigs. Could I see the dessert menu, please? Feeding a guinea pig is fun. Cleaning a cage is less fun. But it must be done. If it's not, The cage will become a guinea pig sty, and that can make your guinea pig sick. Clean out everything inside the cage. Put in new bedding. Now that we, you've taken care of the basics, you need to tame your guinea pig. If you don't, he'll be afraid and he won't come out to play. Let's play hide and seek, but not. Let's play hide, but not seek. Tame your guinea pig first. Sit next to your cage, and talk to him. Once upon a time, there was a boy who loved his guinea pig. Feed him a small piece of carrot from your hand, then pet his head. After several days, your guinea pig will trust you. Now you can carefully pick him up, sit on the floor, and hold him with two hands against your chest. This is a good time to brush your guinea pig. If he has long hair, brush him every day. If you don't, your, his hair will be tangled mess. Plus, guinea pigs like being brushed. It's relaxing. Worst hair day ever. While you brush your guinea pig, make sure it, it's he's healthy. If you see crusty eyes or drooling, or if he stops eating, take him to the vet. When your guinea pig is feeling better, you can play together. Your guinea pig might like to play with a ball or even play outside. Keep him in a, a closed area. Otherwise, your guinea pig might run away. He won't go far, but he might be hard to find. Maybe he is really playing hide and seek. Guinea pigs are really sweet. Found you! So if you're willing to house, feed, water, groom, play, and protect your new pet, maybe you really want a guinea pig. Now I have a question for the guinea pig. You say you want a person. You really, really want a person. But do you really want a person? Of course you do. Good guinea pig, furry. Good person, JJ. Now it's time for the quiz to see if this is the right pet for you. Do you have a spot in your living room or other family gathering area for a cage? Do you have a time and patience to tame an animal? Do you ha can you be calm and careful w with a small animal? 
Can you live with squeaks and chatter of an animal that is noisy at times? No, if no to one, a hamster might be better fit. Guinea pigs crave interaction with people. Hamsters prefer a quieter environment. No to two, an animal that stays in a cage, such as a finch, may be better. No to three, you might be. You might like a larger animal, such as a cat or a dog. No to four, quieter. A no to four, a quieter animal, such as a rabbit or a snake, might be a better fit. Yes to all four questions. A guinea pig might be the right pet for you. So if you really want a guinea pig, convince your parents. Bye.